Mohamed Salah's inclusion in Liverpool's extensive injury roster has jeopardised their pursuit of winning four titles. Mohamed Salah has been added to Liverpool's extensive injury list, leaving them without as many as 10 players. Salah returned from a hamstring injury on Saturday after being sidelined for four weeks and is currently experiencing fatigue. There are doubts about his availability for Wednesday's match against Luton at Anfield and his participation in Sunday's Carabao Cup final against Chelsea is also uncertain. Jurgen Klopp had already lost Diogo Jota, Curtis Jones and Darwin Nunes during Saturday's match against Brentford, making Salah's injury an additional blow. Klopp mentioned that Liverpool is closely monitoring all their injured players on a daily basis. When asked if Salah has aggravated his injury, Klopp stated, It's a similar area where he feels it a little bit. We have to see how it develops. It's nothing serious, but we have to monitor it. Klopp also revealed that Jota would be out for months due to his knee problem, although they hope he will return before the end of April. He added that it's too early to determine a time frame for Jones's return and reassured that Nunes's issue is not severe after he was subbed off at half-time against Brentford as a precaution. Trent Alexander-Arnold and Dominic Soboslai are unlikely to recover from their knee and hamstring problems in time to face Chelsea. Klopp acknowledged the challenges ahead, stating, It's not ideal, definitely not. He emphasised the importance of unity within the team, highlighting that they will persevere with the available players. Liverpool's lengthy injury list poses a significant challenge to their pursuit of multiple titles, with the upcoming match against Luton being the first of eight challenging games, including a clash with Manchester City in a span of 25 days. Despite the setbacks, Klopp remains optimistic, stressing the team's adaptability and the importance of the Anfield crowd in their upcoming fixtures. He also praised Luton boss Rob Edwards for his remarkable work with the team, emphasising the need for a strong home atmosphere, reminiscent of European nights.